Hello and welcome to this video. Today we are watching another match in the Zero AD Pro Series. Through 1v1, Stockfish is playing Romans and Mark Oral as Spartans. Got the kicking hole there, covered up of course in case someone falls in. Farmstead, storehouse, straight away. Stockfish, storehouse straight away. And three Roman Cav. Going to start off with early rushing. Good baskets for Mark Aurel. See this pretty soon. There it is. There goes ladies. There's one. There's two now. No. Not yet. There it is. There's the second one. All of his horses still, still quite healthy. Doing nothing. Dickens. Alright. Three ladies. No anythings. The men get the berries from underneath, and the ladies from on the top. Mark Aurel bringing out two cavalrymen of his own. Taking these chickens. The horses uh, became stuck on each other for a second. Stockfish, nine ahead in population. What is the composition? 12 military units versus 13. But 12 ladies versus many ladies, 18. Five swordsmen. Mascots. The upgrade's been going. Really much for Mark Aurel. No upgrades, I think. In fact, for the fish of stocks. Or a stock of fish. Like a store, a stock. Idle ladies hiding behind here. Oop. 
Six skirmishes and then four skirmishes. Well, ten. Main plow. Stockfish, eleven ahead in population. Oh, here it is. Big troop movement. Looks like about... Yeah. Ten skirmishers, ten swordsmen. <laughs> Mark Aurel will not see this until the very last second. Oh, and here they are. Oh, they're all spread out. Can't quite see. Dogfish doing quite well for KDA. Oh, here's yeah, more of these. Wait. What's happening there? That's a strange bug. If I select it with the this. Right now it is working. Strange. That was a strange bug. I, bug. I, when I was selecting it, there was nothing down there. Three buildings and just boom, boom, boom. Gone. Six more skirmishes coming out. Stockfish, as well as the three horses which are healing up. Whoa, we did a little jump that horse. That man on that horse. Surprised he did not fall off. All these ladies are perishing. This is not good for a civilization. Civilizations were require ladies, in fact. Absolutely require them. No ladies, no civilization. I mean, no men, no civilization either. You could have both. And, uh, Mark Orell, his lady situation here is not looking... not looking sustainable. Stockfish, on the other hand, plenty of lady ness, ladiness. There's a uh, outpost. Currently building or recruiting any units. This is also something that needs to happen.
There we go. Skirmishes. Good. Redis. That's what it sounds like they're saying, the skirmishes. Splitting up these units quite often. Mark Oral trailing in population by 40 now. Stockfish literally running circles around Mark Oral. Literally. Went all the way around. Once those units come to here, that will be a full circle. Running rings around, I think is the uh, colloquialism. Another vigilarium over here. Very vigilant. Oh, look at them. So vigilant. No vision for Mark. All vision for Stockfish. If these had uh, carrier pigeons, that would be quite a lot of vision. E. It will be as soon as Mark Oriel notices that he's surrounded by things, that's when the resignation will surely occur. Being the weakest units inside of the, uh, yeah. Being the weakest units inside of the Vigilarium. Very nice. Oh, just decimating the civilization here. What kind of field is this that's growing in the snow like this? Snow wheat. Snow wheat. Oh dear. How many units does Gaia have? Oh, it doesn't. <laughs> I wish it would show up the top. Yes, I do. Hmm. Each player played well. Stockfish came out on top on this day. Twice as many buildings. Almost twice as many units. Almost twice as many resources. Double almost of everything. Very well played. I hope that you found that to be interesting, and I hope that you have a good day.